What's up, guys? So, it's the fourth day of Christmas, I believe. Counting down to Christmas. Um, so I'm gonna start right with this. Uh, your questions, topics, put them in the comments, and I'll try to get to them. So, so, Akil Sharma says, If you could have your dream team of all the Dragon Age, uh, Origins and Dragon Age 2, and Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3 characters, what would your team of five include? <sighs> Garrus? That's it. No, I'm just kidding. Garrus. Ogryn. Alistair. Legion. There's so many, though. I think I'm probably have to go, gonna have to go for Rex. But I would, I would really love Shale as well. Oh. Mm. And Varric, there's so many, but the first five, I guess, I'll go for the, with my first choices. But there's, there's too many for me to choose just five. Um, Amazing says, if you could clone Shepard and have, uh, I mean, and you have to choose to clone either a Shepard Parag Paragade, Parag Paragon, or a Shepard Renegade, which would you choose and how many? I think I would choose... I think I'd choose Paragon, because Renegade Shepard, as funny as he could be sometimes, he could be a jerk. Like, he could be really messed up sometimes. So I think Paragon, um, and I think, I don't know how many. <laughs> I, I, it depends on what I would want him for. <laughs> if I wanted, I, I would, I don't know, five. No, three. Three Shepherds could get a lot of things done, so three. Uh, Dave Incognito, your Starbound collaboration got me to thinking, based on your experience with Starbound, would you continue to play betas ver beta versions of PC games, or would you rather wait for the full release? I would, I would love to play betas, but I'm using a Mac, so I'm not getting the full experience of a PC gaming, of PC gaming, because for those of you that know, m gaming on Macs is not a good idea. I mean... Macs are great for multimedia, but not for gaming. Like PC, I want a gaming a, a, a PC for gaming only, and my Mac for for multimedia. So playing on my Mac, I've been I've encountered a lot of issues. Um, so I, as much as I would love to, I think I would probably wait until I got a PC. Um, once I get a PC, of course, like I would totally get into betas. I love betas. Um, but yeah, with Mac, I'd have to really, really look forward to it. Like, I'd have to really want the game. Um, like the Elder Scrolls Online, I signed up for the Mac beta. Um, but I, I, I would prevent playing on my Mac as much as possible. Um, Yaniv Cohen... Uh, says, I've noticed you love time travel. Did you watch Doctor Who in the past? Uh, and if so, who's your favorite Doctor? I've never watched Doctor Who. Um, I really want to, though, because I feel like that's my sh type of show. I feel like I would love that show. But I've never actually sat down and watched it. I did sit down and watch the first season, like the first episode ever. And I was like, I was kind of bored with it. But I've heard that it's not really the best place to start. Like, it's better to start later. And then go back and watch the other ones. Like, once you already fall in love with the series. I don't know. So, let me know in the comments. For you Doctor Who fans, let me know in the comments what season I should start watching. Um, Reverend Trigster says, Who are your top three favorite anime characters and why? <sighs> um... I want to say I really loved Vegeta. Vegeta was one of my favorite anime characters. I just, I, just, I don't know. I just thought he was awesome. Uh, so I'm going to say Vegeta. I, th I'm, I can't think of a lot of other animes. Oh, um, 
Oh my god, what's his name? In um, Cowboy Bebop, the the not Spike, the other guy. I think he has like a me like a metallic arm. I haven't seen that anime in a long time. I really want to though. I should go back and watch it. The the his partner, his his like best friend. I loved that character, and I forgot his name. It's been years since I watched it. So him, and I'm leaving out so many characters. I want to say Bato. He's the one that's like in my mind from Ghost in the Shell. You guys reminded me the name. That's the one I was thinking of. Ghost in the Shell. Bato from Ghost in the Shell. I love him. Um, there's so many others, but those are the first that come to mind. Um, I know I'm going to remember an, an anime character where I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> that scared me. Um... Hawkfin Proprietor says, Would a live-action ad adaptation of the Mass Effect trilogy do better as a movie or a TV series? I think a movie. I feel like sci-fis do better with movie because of CGI and all that. And TV series um, could probably be better for like fantasies, like Game of Thrones and all that. I mean, Game of Thrones has a really big budget, though. Um, but I think... I think... That's how I see things. I feel like sci-fis are probably better with movies. Um, I think it all, it's, it all depends on who's doing it, though. If they do it right, I think they could do it justice. N either way, Nadav Nevo says, Did you watch the Felicia Day Dragon Age uh, web series? If so, what did you think? I did see it. I think it was called Redemption or something like that. I forgot what it was called, but I did see it with Talus. <sighs> I didn't like it. I, I, I was like... Uh, whatever. I, I really didn't... I didn't care about it. <laughs> I was like, alright. It wasn't... It, I didn't find it interesting. I'm not a big fan of Felicia Day. I mean, I don't mind her. But I'm... It's not like I'm gonna love everything she touches. Um, so yeah, I, I, I wasn't... I was like... Whatever. <laughs> Flower Child, did you play Poke... Uh, Flower Child says, did you play Pokemon X and Y? I did. I did. I played Pokemon X... I didn't beat it, though. I want to. Uh, if you did, what was your Pokemon team? I know I started off with... Oh my god, what was his name? I have my 3DS right here, but it, it doesn't have uh, Pokemon. It has a Fire Emblem. I went back to playing that game because that game is so good. Um, I know I had Pidgeot or Pidgeotto. Pidgeot. I had Pidgeot. Um, Bulbasaur. No, he's Venusaur now. Pikachu. So Bulbasaur, Pikachu, um, Venusaur. Pidgeot. Did I count him? No. Pidgeot. Um, that chicken, the fire chicken. What's his name? I forgot. I forgot his name, but the fire chicken. Um and. My my starter, the grass starter, Chespin. He was evolved. I forgot his first his, his name. He was evolved. He was the second evolution of that of him. I think that's it, isn't it? Six. I haven't played it in a while. <laughs> um, and then I I I don't know all the Pokemon. I know the first generation of the Pokemon. About that's when I was really big on it. After that, I mean the the last Pokemon that I remember. Uh, the new ones was Mewtwo. So everything after Mewtwo, pfft, I have no clue. Um, Nyarlazothoth? <laughs> Do you think the art style of The Walking Dead is the reason the storylines are so effective? No. The storylines are effective because of the writing, not the art. Um... Lurtz, what's your favorite? Lurtz says, "What's your favorite race in Lord of the Rings, and who's your favorite character?" Did you see The Hobbit too? Um, my favorite race, I I think the dwarves. I love the dwarves. Um, who's my favorite character? I have I don't I I can't say who's my favorite character. Maybe Gandalf is my favorite character, but I have 
a lot of really close favorites. Um, the three, some of my like the three, my three favorites are definitely Gandalf, Boromir, and Aragorn. Aragorn, Aragorn. Um, but I think Gandalf is my favorite. Um, Max, I couldn't find where it was. Max Gonzalez says, "Hey, MD, I would like to know what jobs you have." held in the past or present and what do you see yourself doing in the future um some jobs my first job was a hostess at a restaurant which i hated <laughs> i hate working in in, in restaurants so hostess um for those i don't know if everybody calls them hostess but they're like greeters and they sit people down and they do a lot of stuff they don't just sit people down my god we did pretty much everything everything we did things that waiters did and we were never treated as such we never got tips <laughs> um so uh yeah hostess first cashier at a grocery store um Oh, my favorite. This was my favorite. I worked at a bookstore. That was my favorite job ever. Um, bookstore, just organizing books. Um, I, I love that. I love that job. My favorite. And then after that, oh, my hair is so nasty. I just got out of the shower, so it's like... <laughs> it's so fringy now. Um, after that, after the bookstore came, I, was wor I worked as um, a biller at a... At a doctor's office which was <sighs> that was hard that was so hard um this it was so much stress and ugh uh just dealing with insurances um after the doctor's office what did I do I think that's af after that oh and I was a tutor I, I tutored um at my at my uni at the college that I went to, I tutored English, um, writing and all that. So um, that was the last job I had, and then caregiver, which is what I'm doing now, which is taking care of my mom. Um, what do I see myself in the future? Is that what they said? Yeah, doing in the future. I hope one day, um, I I really my dream job is to write for video games. So hopefully, that. That's what I hope to be doing in the future. Um, Brian Mc Mikhailov says, Have you ever been interested in the Halo series? I find it interesting, but I've never really gotten into it, like me playing it. Um, but I would watch my brother play like Halo 3 and all that. Um, Frank Garbo says, Oh, my hair is horrible. It's so nasty. I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, Frank Garbo says, Mass Effect Trilogy or Dragon Age Trilogy, I know they are both amazing and different, but which were you more into, uh, like, meant more, uh, to you, had more of a connection with the characters and such, which meant more to you, or, and which you had more c uh, connection with the characters? I honestly can't answer that. <laughs> I don't know, I mean... They both mean so much to me. I mean, Mass Effect was my introduction to Bioware, so it's special to me. Um, it was pretty much the the game that kind of geared me towards the gamer that I am now. It was a, one of the first games that I played that was like that, that was more than what I had been used to, like Nintendo games. So it, it's, it has so much meaning to me, and the characters I connected so much. And Dragon Age, the same thing. I mean, I, I had such amazing experiences with Dragon Age that I just, it's so, so special to me. I think I probably connected a little bit more with some of the characters in Dragon Age because there was more, more conversation, more banter and all that. So I think, I, I guess, I don't know. I really don't know. This is not going to upload, but I want to say I had more connection with Dragon Age when it comes to the characters. I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm going to do a bonus.